Certainly a sad day for all who know George Regis, because there is very little doubt he is the one who crashed into the mountain. Sky 8 was overhead as expert mountaineers made their way to the crash site this morning. Members of the Crag Rats, the Oregon Air National Guard, and Air Force Reserve all involved. They knew this was not a rescue, but a recovery mission. And despite great weather conditions, Sergeant Pete Hughes told us via FaceTime, it's not an easy one. It's quite a trip up. There's quite an elevation change. We went up to about the 8,700 foot level at the Elliott Glacier headwall. And um, they safely got up there. You can see the plane's fuselage up on the glacier. The plane's engine and the pilot had fallen down below. They got to him and are bringing him out. We know from experience that it's... Uh, it's really devastating for the family when they can't bring somebody home. And so the situation's good as yeah. far as us being able to yeah. bring them home. Yeah, at least some closure for them. The Hood River County Sheriff's Office says removing the plane from the mountain is up to the U.S. Forest Service, and they are formulating a plan for that. Brenda. All right. Thank you very much, Tim. Of course, we will continue following this story and we'll bring you any new information as soon as we get it. You can also go to the KGW News app and our KGW Facebook page.